Hello there, I'm Giant Grotal with more Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Whiskey Team. In the last part, we took on the Frosty Grotto, which was eight, uh, five floors, and we uh, finally beat Articuno on the fifth floor as in a boss battle. It took me four takes to beat it, but we finally did it, so it's awesome. Um, yeah, so, um, this icy mountain path seems to go on forever. Also, Absol joined our team and helped save us uh, when Articuno was gonna attack us again. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. This is this icy math path seems to go on forever. We were we were walked we walked a long way here. Cody looks exhausted too. We've been running all this time out of desperation. What's in store for us ahead? Are we really doing the right thing? Burr, this is so too cold. There's nothing but snow now. The scenery's been the same for a while. I wonder if we're really making progress. Hey Steven, I was thinking, I think we've come to a place that that's empty except for us. I have this feeling there's nothing ahead of here, even if we keep moving. And I'm getting exhausted. We too, what's going to happen to us? Ah, uh, don't worry, but we'll be fine, Cody. Sure, that's right. There isn't any point in wondering in wandering wondering about what might happen. Not after coming this far. Sorry, Steven, I was just feeling sorry for myself. That's okay, Cody. I have faith in you, Steven. That's why that's what brought me here. And that's not cha changing. I still have faith in you, Steven. I'll keep going wherever you go. Yes. Cody trusts me without any doubt. I can't afford to be indecisive. I have to be, I have to believe in myself more. Oh man, I don't feel so good. What? What was that? Oh man, I still don't feel so good. Dizzy? Or what? Huh? Is there something wrong, Steven? Finally. Finally, you have arrived. Someone, someone is talking to me. Cody? No, the, that voice isn't Cody. That vo this voice, I've heard it somewhere. Finally. You have arrived. Oh look, it's Gardevoir. Awesome. I've been waiting for you. Good Gardevoir. I kind of like there was an exclamation point when or uh, exclamation mark when there was been a, been a question mark because it was Gardevoir as like a question. I am so glad. Finally, we get to meet. You're what? Everyone's just looking around. Steven, is something the matter? Why aren't you talking? Why are you talking to yourself? I cannot be seen by others. I am only visible only I am only visible I am visible only to you. A little further farther ahead there is a jagged mountain range topped by Mount Freeze. Inside this its peak, Ninetales lives. And then the Ninetales Ninetales awaits your arrival. Beware. Oh wait. Hey Steven, Steven. What's the matter? What happened? Oh, so something like that happened. Gardevoir appeared to you. That's why you were looking so stunned earlier. I'm amazed. I'm amazed though. Ninetales isn't just a legend. It will exist. And that's and that Ninetales is up at the peak. Sniffle. Steven. All the effort we put into getting here. It's finally going to be bear fruit. We'll meet Nantels and get the truth. We'll finally get rid of the suspicions other of the suspicions others have about you, Stephen. Awesome. Now I think this doesn't matter which one you say. Like it did when um, it didn't matter like when Wombre said at the square like, "Are you part of the Nantels legend?" So like the one you pick is um, you'll just it's still advance in the game, but like. I'd be happy with this time because they don't attack you and stuff like you don't get hurt basically by the people in Pokemon Square. Okay, listen, Steven, don't be so worried. It's it will be all right. It's not. It's only natural that you would be scared of meeting Ninetales, Steven, the heartless human who dis who abandoned Gardevoir. It may be you. Yeah, that's what I'm afraid of. I can't understand how you. I can't understand how you could think that but that's impossible you're a human you're not that human i'm sure uh you believe so much in me cody hmm well that's was a time where well there was times there was 
Well, there was a time where I had some doubts, but now I wonder why. I really don't know why, but that but it's all right. Steven, you're a really good sort. You know, before when I first got the idea to start a rescue team, I met you in the tiny woods, Steven. Now I, that I think about it, there was something different about you. It's, it's so tra it is so strange, isn't it? But Steven, I believe in you. Anyways, we'll know the truth when we get to the peak. Steven, let's do our best. Okay, so um, the fr the Mount Freeze is only 20 floors. I say only 20 floors is the longest dungeon, but it's the first 15 floors. Uh, um, you go through 15 floors and there's a save point, and then you go through like another five floors. So um, there's no boss fights. I'm, I'm not gonna save on screen because I don't want my I don't want to overwrite the cutscene if I have a failed recording. And I had a failed recording where I, I, I well, I had this smart idea where, like, oh, if there's no boss fights, I shouldn't take any revival seeds. But now I know that I need at least my one revival seed that I have. So let me just store some items real quick. Let's store the cherry bird, the white gummy, the special band, the, I'll keep the link box, keep the revival seed plant seed, and yeah. I'm gonna also throw away my used TM, I guess, just so I have space in my, another spot in my bag. Want to say yes? There we go. Okay, so check storage door. I don't think I have to store any more else. Okay, take. What can I take? Um, I think I'll take some orange berries, I guess, and some apples. Take three apples and orange berries. Take three orange berries, and I should be good. Let me just double check my items. Yeah, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna take a link box in the dungeon because I, because um, Apple can. I want to link some moves with Apple's moves on his move set. So yeah, whenever you're ready, you can talk to your partner in my case, Cody, and he'll say, "Hey, sir, hi, Steven, or whoever your name character. Are you ready?" And we can say, "All set." Which where? Uh, which way should we go? Now, snow path is the same for floors for a training dungeon and to get items. So yeah, take. Oh, let's get go to the Mount Freeze though. That's where we want to go. Okay, let's go. Let's do our best to reach the peak. Nice. So Mount Freeze 4 1, okay, first 4, whatever. 1 4. How do you want to say it? Is this a Tangela or? Oh, it's a Pineco thing. Um, Yeah, let's me. Um, let's just use Water Gun on this thing. Oh, it has Explosion or whatever that was. Self Destruct. I didn't know that before. Oh, great. No. Okay, um, yeah, let's link some moves on Apsil real quick, just cuz, use, and, okay, let's link, um, let's link quick attack and weir, so, link, and let's link scratch and taunt, well, I don't think we have to do that actually, let's just link quick attack and weir. You don't want the link box, yes. And I think when you do use a link box, it goes away. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Okay. Um, let me go through my moves one more time with my team. Okay. Um, I want Cody to use scratch and medical and brick break. And yeah, that's good. Let's keep taunt. I'll keep taunt. Yeah, taunt can still be there. Um. And one more thing is we want to switch move Cody's IQ, or ch yeah, check IQ to item catcher, course tracker, items master. And yeah, there we go. It's the select exclusive move user. Other than that, we should be ready to go. Let's go this way because I know there's a shield gone over there and I want to deal with it. Please don't be a Okay, good. It was not dead end. Okay, of course there's a shield gone over here. So, let's just use water gun on this thing. Yeah, if we can, like, 
if you can corner enemies like what I'm doing right now, like a little corner or L shape, then um you can like do you everyone can just do damage on the one Pokemon. So that's really helpful, honestly. Uh, please don't be a dead end. Oh, it's just a loop around, of course. Like, let's go up then. There we go. Don't get separated, you guys. Let's go left then. And without that, without further ado, okay, there's also a water dungeon, uh, there's also water in this dungeon, so, like, you water types can walk on water, so that's cool, I guess. Other than that, that's all I have to say, so let's hit the music, I guess. Oh, and by the way, I should say, I ain't the ones who like gravel rocks, so... They kind of have the same purpose, like they're attacking items, I guess you could say. Okay, so I think um, the stairs are right there, of course, so but I want to take out these sub vipers real quick. And since, since I have Dig, I'll be super effective because it's ground type move on a poison type Pokemon. So there we go, let's grab the gravel box and get out of here. So I think that's the um, first part of the dungeon. So yeah, here's a save point. You can save your game, but you can't go to your storage and take store take items, but that's okay. It's a safe point. So yeah, this has been the end of my Pokemon Mission Dungeon Rose Rescue Team Walk the Guide part. The next part will take on, hopefully, the rest of this, um, the Mount Freeze, and then hopefully figure out the truth when we go see Ninetales at the peak. So this has been Drago again. I would like to thank you again. Goodbye, and I'll see you guys in the next part of my Pokemon Mission Dungeon Rose Rescue Team Walkthrough Guide.